War Diary Day 516 of Russia's war against Ukraine. Early on in the Second World War, when the Germans were having a real go at Britain, I think during the Blitz, or it may have been later, Churchill told the RAF to go and bomb Berlin. Uh, this was very dodgy in those days. Uh, the RAF didn't have the, um, the kit necessary to carry this off without serious risk, but the Royal Air Force did it anyway. Berlin got bombed, no great significant damage was done, but a point was made. Hey, Germans, you do realise that the Nazis have got you into a ton of trouble. This isn't going to be cost free. And in the same way, the Ukrainian drones, one suspects, they haven't confirmed it, but drones have attacked Moscow, including hitting we believe a Russian Ministry of Defence bot factory. Now this is symbolic, but the symbolism is strong and plain. Yesterday, Russia hit Odessa Cathedral with cruise missiles. The Ukrainians, it seems, retaliate by hitting the dead centre of Russia's life factory. So this, while, while the Russians target civilian and sacral targets, the Ukrainians do their best to knock out the Russian life factory and the Russian killing machine. And so it goes on and so it goes on. But once again, what this means is that Vladimir Putin's story to Russia is that this is a special military operation, that Russia will win, that Russian's force and strength will, will overcome all, all problems. This is a big lie. And the drone attack on Moscow is further evidence that Vladimir Putin is full of sound and fury signifying nothing, Vladimir Putin.